Shall we pray? <clears throat> to the one who leaves, the one who exists, to the God of heaven, the King of kings, we give glory and honor and praise. Thank you for such a day as this. Thank you for ministering to our hearts. And thank you for today. We now know what it means to have an experience with you, O oh God. We pray therefore, Father, laying on the altar of prayer, firstly, that God, you may give us the strength. Our hearts and our knees are shaking. We are weak. Life has tossed us to and fro. And we do not know where to go. But my Father, we pray, if you could do it for Moses, if you could do it for Daniel, if you could do it for, for David, if you could do it for all those people that started weak and ended up at the better level, we know you can do it for us as well. And secondly, God, we pray that you touch our eyes, that we may have those shackles fall from our eyes, Blindness has stricken us, and we have compromised and enjoyed mediocrity. Help us, therefore, to set our eyes on the things that are above, so that we can pursue excellence in all our endeavors. And most importantly, we pray for our spirituality. While the devil is uh, roaring around like a lion, looking for someone that he may devour, we pray that we may shelter under the wings of the Almighty, so that we can be saved there in that corner when no one else is taking note. Father, we pray that we may be able to excel. And finally, as a pastor in this house, I rise up in the action of the Holy Spirit, and I speak against every foul spirit, every demon. I rebuke it in the name of Jesus. And right now, we tell the devil there is a higher ranking in town, and we are speaking authority that your children are declared free. For whoever that the Son of Man sets free is free indeed. We know and by this we do know that you are God, you are King and you are Lord and you will reign forever with us, forevermore in Jesus name everybody with faith and is in pursuit of excellence say amen and amen Amen